shadow prediction for zodiac sign Aquarius. Second week of September. So my friends, let's get started. As usual, I will start with love reading and love message and then I will talk about general aspect situation on some message for your life. So whether you are single or attached, man or woman, young or older, you are welcome to stay tuned with us. Okay, my dear Aquarians, let me see. The very first tarot card is flow. So honey, go with the flow. Don't be nervous. Don't be impatient. Simply go with the flow. Realize your true nature and everything will be just fine. So, major kind of flow is a tarot card which have different names in different decks. By the way, this is a Wheel of Fortune. So, you see guys, you know, maybe you are happy, maybe you are not that very happy. But major this tarot card flow or major arcana wheel of fortune basically uh, will want to describe that even you experience a maybe uncertainty place beneath this heaven sky is like you know guaranteed that you will get what you want. This very second maybe you do not want who is coming in your life or what you can expect with with your current partner. But honey, don't sweat about uh, your love life, you know, too much. Because you know the truth. Some of you are still seeking for the truth. And, you know, the truth will set you free. So, obviously, uh, some of you maybe experience some insecurity. Maybe you want to know, is your current partner the best one for you and for your future? To tell you the truth, guys... Probably this person is good for you, especially if you experience, you know, somebody who is about, you know, saying the truth. But some of you cannot find a piece of your mind because, guys, I need to admit, you know, some of you, maybe you are a little bit, you know, uncertain, you know, is your current partner saying you the truth. My deck will show, guys, you know, what you can expect. But for now, stick to your truth, be who you are. Go with the flow and expect the best. Obviously, you are dealing uh, with something. Some of you, you are going maybe to memory through the memory line, thinking and asking still, you know, how come that your ex didn't say, you know, the whole white truth. So, guys, there is a reason for everything. So now let me see who is this person who is willing to tell you the truth. Maybe finally you will realize that someone is in love with you. Maybe finally now you will hear truthful words of admitting Major Arcana the Emperor. This is very powerful person. This is probably Eris. Could be any other astrological sign as well. Uh, Leo, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, even Libra. And this person is about the truth. And this person probably talks about that already. Or if you're still single, this person first you will hear, uh, you know, let's stick, you know, to the truth. You know, I don't like people who are lying. I really don't like people who are manipulating. I really don't like, you know, weird type of a thing, you know, um, psychopaths or, you know, whatever. So from this day on, from the, from the day first, Speak only the truth with me. And I can see smile on your face because, you know, this is your thing as well. So, you don't like silly, superficial people who like to, you know, play games with you. And for sure, this emperor is very structured, very organized person. Could be Scorpio, could be Virgo as well this is a very powerful person guys just look at this beautiful beautiful tarot card how precise this art is beautiful beautiful so you can see this person holds two scepters two not one and guys you can see the light so obviously this is like uh, enlightenment you will understand something big about current or previous relationship, 
but above all about you. Probably you do not want to move your little finger in order to save to save uh, ex um, partner or previous relationship because now probably somebody will say something to you uh, not that much about maybe even about your current partner but I think that you will like this comment you know because this person is bringing light and enlightenment in your life so this could be your colleague your boss or person of big authoritative signature in his life queen of wands once again guys very very strong tarot card very strong tarot card Aries Leo Sage very powerful person this could be, this also could be one aspect of you uh, you are very fiery from inside but nobody can see that you see guys um, people do not see that uh, in you but you can be very passionate if you want to do such a thing and when you want to be very passionate so other people can say that you are very cold you are not cold but also you don't like to show romantic you know feelings generally speaking especially not publicly and you do not want to show how passionate you are if you are not 100% sure about your partner so you can see this queen of wands is wearing a mask maybe this is you asking yourself can i trust this person you see guys the truth is the most profound the most important thing which is on your mind guys let me tell you one thing so many of you you will contact astrologers tarot readers so many of you because you want to know the truth this is first on your mind give me the truth up until then until you are like sure like really really sure you ain't gonna be able to go with the flow you can be a little bit you know nervous before you feel and see that this relationship is for real and guys i think it is it is some of you need to be very patient especially with your father your father, maybe even a mother, or one of them, will know so much about your current relationship and current partner. And, you know, you will ask advices, you know, what can I expect from this person? Queen of Swords, honey, this is you, because this tarot card represents Aquarius, female and male in general readings, but also Libra or Gemini. So, once again, the theme of wearing a mask maybe you're a little bit unsure what your partner want from you so honey just ask your partner okay can you see the truth so the truth the truth and nothing but the truth so help me god obviously somebody see that inside of you and this person ain't gonna play with you because uh you know uh, people can feel that you know um, you can see, you know, people people communicate in a, such a different type of a way. Every single one of us is unique. And somebody will see this uniqueness inside of you. I cannot play with this Aquarius, Aquarian uh, man or woman. I need to be very straightforward. I need to say, to speak only the truth. Because, you know, if I am going to do that, my Aquarius will be mad or simply the you will you can be you can be so detached you know not uh maybe in this week but generally speaking you know so this is you kind of you know testing you know this person what you want from me and somebody is trying to show to you i'm worth of you give me a chance i'm so worth of you and being in a relationship with you major or kind of the hangman okay if you are in a relationship with Aquarian, Aquarius man or woman, if you are a different astrological sign watching this video, pay attention. Aquarius people, they do not like um, patronizing. Don't do that. Never ever. So somebody is, you know, awaiting, you know, for, uh, for some sign, smile at least on your face. So guys, major kind of the hangman. Even you, you ain't gonna be very 
uh, you ain't gonna be hasty uh, you ain't gonna allow person to enter into your life until you see this is like you know for sure and you must explain to this person uh, wait on me give me some more time I cannot just jump into your bed just like that you know if you think that I'm worth of you you will wait and this is guys exactly what I can see in one sentence somebody is coming in your life maybe this is your current partner who will buy a lot of present because somebody want to impress you whether this is your current partner or maybe this is your potential love partner and be careful what you are saying to your friends be careful be careful all I'm saying you don't need to share every single detail so keep you know something about your love life for yourself okay and now general reading I will pull two tarot cards let me see the most important specific message guys for you first tarot card knight of wands breakthrough finally this is probably something that you expected and nothing happened in July and August so now is the right time for you to act excellent for creativity excellent for big group of people excellent for love you have two suitors Cancer Pisces Scorpio Leo Sage Aries almost equally good but different in nature uh, breakthrough you will feel this impulse of you know breakthrough inside of you you will be very courageous so what you never ever believed it's possible and maybe just recently now it's possible because you are very energetic optimistic you have clarity on your mind you are very creative and this is your rushing to achieve whatever you want to achieve so progress I can see I can see success on your way those two people can help you could be your parents could be spouse, could be friend, could be neighbor, neighbor could be colleague, uh, or could be two aspects of you, two aspects of you. Nine of Cups, guys, romance, romance is on your mind, and this person think highly of you, highly, especially Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Leo, Sage, or Eris, could be the one. Be uh, nice, be polite, uh, be slow with this person, this person will open his heart or her heart depends of course on the gender to you so don't hurt this person because this person is real slow sensitive and show patience this person ain't gonna open towards you just like that so just remember you also can act in a such a way so now you need to respect the rhythm the pace of this love partner so romantic good news are coming your heart make sure to be open and to receive Aquarius if you're single I can see clearly you are finally ready to love and this is your weekly prediction make sure to subscribe on my channel my dear friends Please share this video with your friends and like this video. God bless!